let's try another knot. How about the bowline? Here, we'll use this stanchion. I'm going to pull the long end tight. I'm going to hold it there while I make a loop by pulling part of it back and under. Then I'm going to take the short end and bring it through the loop. I'll have the two sides parallel there. Then I'll wrap the short end behind the long end and bring it back through the loop and pull it tight. That's a bowline. Would you like to try it? Sure. All right, let me untie it. There you go. Thanks. Let me see if I got this. I take the long end, push it forward and under to make a loop like this. Take the short end, bring it up and under, down, around, and back through. Pull it tight, and there's my bowline. You've got it. Sailors use a bowline when they're tying a jib sheet to the jib. It needs to withstand several thousand pounds of pressure. The nice thing about it is, even though it can do that, it's very easy to untie, simply by loosening the back loop and pulling this through. Another use of a bowlin is for making a big loop in a line. For example, when you're coming into a gas dock and you need to throw the loop over a piling. Can you do a bowlin that way? I think so. Let me try. Okay, well first I need some more line to make the loop. That should do. Now I'm going to take the long end, push it forward and under to make a loop like this. Take the short end, bring it up, down, around the long end, back up, and through the loop. Now I'm just going to pull it tight. That's my bowline. Is this big enough? That looks great. 